Hey Vic, my name is Charles and last week I attended the Justin Michael Williams event which was a part of Wellness Week. To be honest, I don't usually go to these types of events but I actually found this one to be pretty inspiring. Justin is an insanely good speaker and he talked a lot about sort of being the best version of yourself, especially in the mental and spiritual aspect. So if you missed it, here is a little recap from my own personal perspective. The whole presentation was recorded by the way, so if that's something you're interested in, the link will be somewhere. <laughs> Throughout the presentation, Justin shared a bunch of really insightful thoughts. One of the first ones that I picked up on was the idea that fear and faith are the exact same thing. And this is because both of them require you to believe in something that you can't see and hasn't happened yet. In other words, they're two sides of the same coin, but it's up to you to choose either the more optimistic side of faith or the more pessimistic side of fear. Whatever's happening in our lives or with our trauma or in the world, we have a choice. Are we choosing to believe in fear or are we choosing to believe in faith? Because guess what? You're going to believe in something. Another part of the presentation that was definitely a highlight for me was the dream bigger practice. This was both a visualization and a breathing exercise, which sort of got us thinking about our future selves with absolutely no limitations. It was really cool for me because recently I've been feeling somewhat uncertain about my own objectives in life, but through this process, I probably got the clearest view of my ideal future that I've ever gotten. And a really good point that Justin made is that this practice puts the focus and power on ourselves rather than some external factor that's outside of our control. But the real point of meditation is to realize that the guru is within you. Yes, you. Y'all know I'm serious when I'm hitting the screen. It's in you. Through the Dream Bigger practice, I also discovered a couple of things that I need to manifest more in my own life to reach this future, which takes me into Justin's next topic of unique energy signatures. These signatures were essentially the most notable words that came up during the practice. For me, those words ended up being love and compassion. We also got the chance to share our signatures with everyone else, so it was cool to see that others wanted to practice more patience, confidence, trust, and things along those lines. There were like 200 people watching this live, by the way, so there were a bunch of awesome thoughts and ideas being thrown around, which I thought was really cool and interactive. And what, pr what you all prove to me right now is you know what you need. And this is what I mean by the internal work that we're doing is how we change the external world around us. Even though Wellness Week has already passed, supporting your wellness shouldn't be limited to only one week. So to finish off the presentation, Justin kindly surprised us with his new 40 day freedom meditation course which is available for all UVic students, even if you didn't attend, for free. Each session is only about 10 to 15 minutes long, very low stress. So if that's something you're interested in, definitely check it out. That was pretty much the presentation. Obviously, I couldn't cover everything, so I would highly recommend checking out the full recording. You can also find the link to Justin's free 40-day meditation course in that same recording. Hope you enjoyed this little recap and take care.